Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to get the half speed effect in Ableton Live without the use of gross speed. Uh, if you don't know what the effect sounds like, uh, I'm going to open up gross speed, select half speed, and let me disable this real quick. So this is how it sounds without the effect. Pretty simple. Next, we're going to enable growth speed. All right, so we get the point. So it stretches it out uh, over time. So let me close this. I'm going to disable this. Now, in order to get this effect, first, you want to select the MIDI track that you like to uh, apply the effect to. Hit freeze track. Next, holding down the option button. Uh, Drag the clip into the uh, new audio track. All right, I'm going to solo this for now. Next, we're going to hit uh, consolidate. And then we're going to hit the double original tempo button here. And we're going to hit the repitch button to repitch and stretch the uh, sample out. And this is how it sounds. Now, depending on a, the, the portion of the, your audio file that you like to loop, you can just uh, hit the Command E button after selecting it and just hit Duplicate. And uh, you can join this by compressing the Command J button. And this is how it sounds. It sounds exactly like the effect. So we're going to unfreeze this track and we're going to audition this one as well to see if it does sound the same. See? Right, so it's pretty much it. Uh, let's see how it sounds with our beat here. Uh, thanks for watching guys. If you have any questions or any suggestions for any uh, other tutorials, please leave a comment in the uh, comment section below.